Hello, here I am again. <clears throat> well, actually, I don't know when. I'll put this up. Anyway. My eyes look very blue today, don't they? Can you actually finally tell that they're blue now? Because they are. Yeah, so... I had a good Christmas. And my point of talking about my blue eyes is that if you wear eyeshadow with gold or like bronzy, orangey, warm, yellowy, tawny tones, any any one of those, it will make your eyes more bluer. Did I just say that? More blue. Anyway. For Christmas, I got some little cubic zirconium studs, because I said that I wanted some. And I got this sweatshirt, which is a big deal, because it came all the way from England. It's my slogan. Keep calm and carry on. And then it has, it even has a little one right there, which I think is so cute. And I'm very particular about my sweatshirts. I don't like uh, I look like I have a beard. I'm Father Christmas. But I don't like when they have zippers like that. I don't like at all. But I like hoods and I like a kangaroo pocket, which this has. You really can't see it. So pretty much it's impossible in the United States of America, in my experience anyway, to find a nice sweatshirt that doesn't have a zipper that has a hoodie. I hate the collared ones. I only like hoodies. Or, um, not crew necks, but I do have one boat neck sweatshirt from Abercrombie and Fitch that I love. So yeah, I'm very happy with this. And even though it doesn't feel soft on the outside, it's very soft on the inside. So yeah. And then I got these brushes from MAC. They are holiday ones. You can tell because they have short handle. I got the 194, which I've never even heard of. But it actually works very well for uh, eyeshadow application. The 275? Yeah. The 266, which I have heard of, the angled brush. The 224, blending brush, great for in the crease. And then this little spoolie, which is the 204. I don't even know if you could see the number, but that's what it looks like. And then they come in this carrying case thing, <clears throat> which to me seems a little bit big as. They only take up about that much space, but I'm not complaining. And then I also got some Toblerone, which I have ate it all. So yeah, that was my Christmas. I'm not going to go showing you everything I got, because I don't want to look like I'm braggy. Excuse me. I don't want to look like I'm bragging, but those are just... The things I had around. This is my new favorite book. Well, I've loved it for a while, but I'm just. I reread it and then now I'm reading it again. And it's The Exploits and Adventures of Miss Alethea. Alethea? I'm not sure how you say it. Darcy. By Elizabeth Ashton, who is the author of. This is Mr. Darcy. Uh, Mr. Darcy's Daughters. And if you'd like. Pride and Prejudice, or any Jane Austen novel, really, you will like that book. Because it is like, okay, what if Mr. and Mrs. Darcy, or Mr. Darcy and Elizabeth Bennet, what if they had five daughters of their own? Ah, what if the youngest one made a disastrous marriage to an awful man and is now running around Europe trying to get away from him? But, here's the catch. 
her disguise is that she's dressed as a man. It's it's really exciting. That's why it's called Exploits and Adventures. So I highly recommend that if you want something to read, which you probably don't because most people in the modern world do not like reading, which makes me sad. But it is true. So I'm excited about these brush thingies because now I can use those other brushes for concealer and other things and these will be my designated eye brushes. I use this, to, I used all of these today actually. I actually f groomed and filled in my eyebrows and then you comb through them with this and then I use this to pack on color onto the lid, this 194. It's kind of a weird looking brush. I've never really. Yeah. But I like how flashy they are with the gold handle. And then this is really good for, like, in the crease. Uh, as is this blending brush. This would actually probably be really good brush to blend in your concealer with, I think. But yeah. Because normally, I don't know if you know this, but normally one of the MAC brushes runs like $30 or something, which is ridiculous. Even though they are good quality. But you get all of these. They have other sets too, different ones. And then this for fifty dollars, not a bad deal, when you consider that ranks that makes each of these worth, or you pay ten. And the only difference is they have a short handle and flashy stuff here, and a little carrying case for free. So it's great value, if you ask me, because you can't have cheap makeup brushes. You really can't. They're just they're just no good. They're just no good. Oh, good. Yeah, so that's all I have to say. Thanks for watching, and I hope you had an excellent Christmas, and I hope you have a splendid New Year. Because I will. I think. I hope. I don't know. Who knows what the future holds, right? Anyway. Bye-bye. <laughs>